Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 7, uh, 19. Farming Simulator 19 folks, here on uh, Ravenport 19. Your host, with uh, not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, I stopped here to pick up the two seed pallets that was here. And that put me up to almost 3,000 liters. Um, all the harvesting is done. I went ahead and done the uh, oats off screen. Mm, sorry about that, folks. I just got carried away with myself and, uh, you know, love driving the combine. That's all it is, too. I just forgot. But anyway, how y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? I am doing good. <sighs> I just, I don't, I guess I'm going to get to Baylor. I done wind road that over while the combine was finishing up. Uh, put the combine in the shed, but I did not repeat. I did not maintain it or anything like that. I just parked it, got it out of the way. Now, I'm trying to think where my trailer is. Um, I think it's up by the sheeps. Um, got 29,000 for the couple missions I did while I go. Um, if y'all watched the last episode, y'all know about them. Um, whoa, 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 whoa. On in. Crooked there, Mr. Blue. Um, yeah, I'm going to be saying that a lot, probably. I, I wish we had a different baler in a way but I'm gonna stick with square bales and see here I need to unfold this thing and I don't know how we're really going to start uh, I guess we'll start high and go low probably would make about the best uh, way of doing it right and that way when we turn on the ends uh, we don't have to fight the hill going up. Alright, let's see here. I need to lower, pick up, turn on baler. And we got a grass bale in there. Eh, or a hay bale. This is going to be a pretty, 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 pretty big wind row. Oh, I thought it was stuck there. May have to come back for some of it. But it was just that little pitch right there. I'm not even going to worry about it. Oh, 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 I got it. Good, 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 good. Um, what I done was took all the ends and wind rolled it where it would be one straight through. There goes that grass bale. Oh, grass bale. We need grass bale. I actually <laughs> said grass bale where I go and I was thinking hay bale. Silly, Mr. Blue. Or Tommy. I need to start using my real name, I guess. Um, YouTube channel is Tommy Miller, so everybody's like, Mr. Blue! And then, oh, 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 I'm going to have to come back for that. Take them. And then uh, when they hear Tommy, and they're like, who is Tommy? But it bees like that sometimes, I guess. Bees like that, yeah. Do, 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 do. By the way, I gotta I gotta look him up. Uh, YouTuber name, uh, well, I don't know his real name, but his channel name's Bees B E E Z S. Um, he does farming similar also, and and Pug G, I guess that's the name of it, and some other things. I really don't know what all they're called, but uh, kind of like uh. Call of Duty, something like that, but it's a different kind. But anyway, uh, I need to go check him out. It's been a long time since I checked him out. Quit hearing anything from him, actually. And uh, you know, that's sad too. Uh, I don't know if everybody's like that or not, but it's like, you know, we'll watch this one person for a while, say like me, and then after so long, you know, something might happen to us, get sick or something, and then. All of a sudden, people just forget about you. Uh, until, like, last minute or something. I'll raise this up so it won't damage it. And uh, they'll be like, uh, 
Well, what, whatever happened to that one guy? What was his name? Mr. Red? Mr. Green? Mr. Orange? Oh, hey, Mr. Orange. Sorry. And, folks, there is a YouTuber out there named Mr. Orange. He does, like, uh, City Skylines, I believe what it's called. There's other games and stuff like that. And, uh, go check him out. Now, I do not have Bees or Mr. Orange down below. I'm sorry. Um, I'm just, uh, yeah. One of those things, folks. Um, I sort of say, hey, I'm done, but, oh, I still got a long ways to go. And yes, I am running my mouth and making probably no sense to anybody. But that's all right. It's a new year. It's a new thing. I'm going to try to stay energized and talkative to, through these instead of like I'm sound asleep, as some of my friends say I sound. Uh, <laughs> no names there. But, uh, yeah. Well, I heard you, you sound like you half asleep on where you was talking about like this. Not making any sense. But anyway, folks, uh, I have had a few people tell me that, and I'm sorry I sound like that if I do. It, it's just, uh, it's rough trying to balance out a YouTube life along with a firefighter slash EMR slash two kids. Why did I shut it off instead of raising it up? Alright, uh, I'm pretty sure <laughs> I said I was going to start at the top and work at the bottom, didn't I? I ended up at the bottom. Guess that's why I shut it off. But anyway, um... This field still needs to be fertilized. I fertilized the others, the big one over there, and, and uh, what was it, 21? Oop, oop, let it down, let it down. Did I let it down the time? I think I did. Because it got slow. <laughs> uh, these duels kind of helps out. We, we got to get a, uh, we need a bigger tractor. Folks, we really, really need a bigger tractor. But anyway. Um, this field needs to be fertilized. And then we can go through and cultivate all of them. And then come in behind the planter. I mean, uh, come in behind the cultivator and fertilize again, I believe. Somewhere in there we got to fertilize again. Uh, let's see here. I'm trying to think. And there was some mods that I did download. Uh, I got the Michigan map. And uh, let's see. What else was there? Besides the Michigan map, I also downloaded. It's like a little miniature pond that you can put in on your map. And... Uh, Trying to debate if I want to do Honeydew or Mission. Uh, I think I'm probably go with Michelin map. Uh, I really can't remember where Honeydew's based out of. I want to say Texas, but don't hold that to me. Now I wish they would uh actually hire a worker with Baylor, you know. But if you do this with course play, if that ever comes to 19, you can, you know, do your first one and get it all set up. And then after that, you're, you're tedding, you're wind rolling, you're bailing, all that lines up on the same path. Makes it a lot better. So far, we're going pretty smooth with all this. Uh, I want to smooth that up over there and get like a couple more of those trees out of there. Smooth it up and maybe a smaller field back there. It had to be something we had to work by hand because all the rocks and stuff that's in the way. Now, the reason why I ain't picking up all these little bitty tiny pieces that skips is we got plenty of straw here. 
The uh, only thing that's going to use straw would be the horses. And it looks like they don't use very much of it. And let's see, we got to hook up to a green trailer and put the rest of the oats into the silo. I don't think the horses need none yet. And I forgot to turn the radio off before I started recording. That's all right. Our phone system around here is getting messed up. The text messaging, it's about an hour behind. I got a fire text the other day, and it was almost like well, over 45 minutes before it come through on my phone. I'm like, oh my goodness. It was just luckily, I uh, had my Gmail open, and I saw the email pop up, and that's, uh, well, no, that wasn't that. That was the other one. Uh, the uh, one that was 45 minutes long, I was actually in a bathtub when it came across, and uh, yeah. The other one that I popped up on the Gmail was a little late on that because I was inside where I didn't have no service either. So, yeah. But if I'm here at the house, I can usually get the Gmails um, they all come through my phone all night long so every time somebody uploads a video or replies to a video or, or fire text comes through or something like that it dings but once I take that sleeping pill <laughs> I don't hear nothing so <laughs> jumping over my head if y'all get that All right, we are on our last through. So, that's working out about right, because it's, the oats is lasting long enough uh, to supply what horses we got now. Now, I do not know what's going to happen once I sell the horses between selling them and rebuying them again is the stuff going to disappear in the troughs or will it stay there or well, that's the question I got but uh we are I think we're low on fertilizer I can't remember But I need to put this in, let's see, it's 1.18 in the evening on the game. So I need to try to do some more missions. And then put this money in the bank of root. Alright, ship that off, raise that up, and unload Baylor. Alright. Now, how many bales was that? Uh... We can go in here, somewhere, somewhere over the rainbow. I don't know. I have that stuck in my head for two or three days now. Uh, mission completed. 103. Uh, transport missions. So, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, it's 110 on the missions, folks, that I've done. Trees cut down is 251. Created bales. Uh, today was 41, but the total is 207. So 41 bales off of this field. Wow. Um. Yeah. Oh, oh trees in the way. Trees in the way. Three, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three is 21. Probably not 21. So. Yeah, that's, that's about right. <laughs> yeah. All right, what should we do next, folks? Um, we need to get the oats put away. And then I want to go into XML files on this uh, uh, seed wagon here and fix it, instead of two, fix it with a whole 4,000. It'd just probably be better. 
Um, we need a bigger shed in a way pretty soon. I need to start putting things in the shed. But I am backing up here. We're going to, I'm going to watch this probably off screen. And I'm going to see if it needs any maintenance because well, it's the second time we done used it. No, third time. Somewhere wrong in there. But I seen we had another fertilized mission to do. So I'll probably, I think it's a small field. Um, we need a um, big tractor like this that has narrow wheels where we can have a weight on the front. Okay, we got 5,983. Um, but this ain't all we got, folks. Uh, I had a little half of a trailer, and I was pulling it with the oven because this one was up there planting. And uh, so, yeah, let's uh, just dump this, and we'll see how much we got all together. I need to check the prices on the soybeans. It's been a little bit. Not that much, but a little bit okay let's go in here and go to here soybeans was 32,000 almost 33 this has went down it was 1631 and I, I should have I, I should go now and sell it because it's still the highest uh, that's at the ranch. It's gonna, it's gonna take a while to get there. So we'll probably just hang in there and see. Oaks, we got twenty-five thousand six hundred twenty-nine. So uh, pork grain elevator look like it's gonna be the highest place if we ever sell any. But we're not gonna sell any. Uh, sheep's doing good. Go down here to our horses, and you can see right here. Probably about thirty thousand completely full. So, but I'm on kind of let this float between quarter to three quarters. Um, in other words, that means when it gets down to a quarter, I'll fill it up. But as long as it's three quarters or more, I won't do nothing at all because I want room for when we sell. You know, it might get fuller when we sell out. But, um, technically the same day as last episode, so all that's going to be good. And I know some of y'all don't like it, but I'm going to repay this money while I'm in here. So y'all can see that. I'm down to 520000 I can go up to one point two five million dollars which should give us a little over what about six hundred thousand four hundred thousand about six hundred thousand yeah now so I could buy a piece of land right now from the bank um Let's go back in here and look at the emissions real quick. Fertilizing 18 is not going to be that much. I probably won't even worry about that. Um, Looks like the only one is, is Bailing Field 9. And that's a lot of equipment to take up there, so I'm going to pass on that too. Um, what does Field 22 have on it, folks? Uh, is that wheat? Folks, that is wheat. Field 22 is wheat. And it's still growing. And it don't look like it need anything. It's completely fertilized. So you know what? This is 280,000. If we borrow that much, it'll give us more room to borrow more money. 
So, uh, I, I, I'm seriously thinking about buying it, folks. Let, let, let's do it. Let me hop out of here. We pretty much got what we need. Uh, might need some more fertilizer and some seeds. Um, we'll see what we got on seeds. We just got to plant our stuff. And we need to get busy planting. So uh, let's go back, back in this part. Uh, I don't know why I jumped out. Because I think I'm about different. Let's uh, play the tapping game here. And get 300,000 out. Whoa, we're over. So that's 875. Um, I'm going to go a little bit more. Gonna, yeah, about right there. I'm going to stop because there's one other thing I won't buy. Um, so let's go in. Oh, what am I doing? Let me go back in here and go over this way. And go to lands. Because see, I still got trees off of this here I need to do. And this way, if I buy this field, I can leave our grass like it is. And I can plant this in wheat. Or I can plant these two soybeans. And then this over here can be wheat. So let's uh let's go ahead and buy this. Yay! And how much we got left? Our balance is 139. <laughs> what do y'all think, folks, huh? Buy another one? That's gonna be the cheapest field we can get. Let's see what's on it. I know it needs to be plowed. Um, so it don't lead lime. Okay. So uh, let's, what's there? Oh, it's growing. Um, Uh-oh. It's sunflowers. We do not have a header for sunflowers. So we're going to have to wait a little bit on that. We're going to have to wait a little bit. Okay, well, we might wait a lot and just go ahead because we got to get some uh, other stuff. And we might even borrow a little bit extra money because um, we, we, we need a good tractor. We really do, but that's going to be up in the money. Now, unless we could just, you know, get a, a cheap AR and not even worry about anything motor-wise and stuff. Uh, Alright, this is the smallest, well not the smallest, the, the biggest AR there is. Uh, it's 379. Now we go down here with the biggest weight, the biggest motor, and I like this setup. It just like it would give it a little bit more power being wider. That's 400,000 right there, so we can't go that big yet. And where's that one? Uh, should be a AR tractory to 300,000. Mm. 290 horsepower. Wide tires, twin wheels, rear trim wheels. Eighty-four is the biggest motor, so that's gonna be four hundred thousand right there, Tommy. So as the yeah, we we uh 
got to wait on these big tractors. Uh, even if we get a 7R, which we already got one. Is that the one? We, yeah, we already got one. Hmm. We do need another tractor, old folks. We really do. All right, let's just see what the uh, well weights, wide tires, wide tires, weight, well, twenty standard. Uh, let's go. We we'll want the. Seventy three tens the biggest. Let's go to Michelin. Wide tires. Uh yeah, no, we don't want Michelin's. That's three hundred thousand right there. And I wait, what what was that? Uh two hundred and 69 horsepower so about 270 I want to see what this plow um, 260 so the 7R can pull the plow uh, this is by Kentucky Farmer and that does uh, we're going to go ahead and get this uh, there's no comments <laughs> I never seen anything fall over in the game. Early. Or, you know, in the in the hood. I just hope it don't do that in real life. Uh we're gonna go ahead and buy this, but we're gonna turn around and probably sell the other big one. Oh no, I don't wanna buy another one. I just want one. I got one. Um these are plows too. We need a bigger cultivator. Uh, now we just need a bigger one. We have this in here. It's 500 horsepower. Uh, 12, 5. This one's 8 and 400 horsepower. See, these uh, wants quite a bit of horsepower. I'm thinking about swapping one we got in for this one. It's 8.3. We might well add another 5,000 to get 12.2. Yeah, we'll just go with the horse. 360. That's a little steep. 340. 240. At four meter. Oh wow. And this is one we got six. So we'll probably just stick with it. We might have to get another one. Who knows? But anyway, I know y'all tired of looking at this. Uh uh We're thirty minutes in, folks. We're thirty minutes in. Uh, let's try this auto load. Um, that should be it right there. We'll just see what this auto load port does. And we'll just take some that way as we go get the trailer. And then uh, what I'll probably do is pick these up off screen. Oh yeah. Now that, that's, that's what I'm talking about right there. You know, sometimes you just gotta have a little auto in your line. You gonna need a weight on the back of this. I see that right now. And three is the tall as it goes, I believe. Yep, three tall. So that will totally help. 
uh, wise unload so uh, let's just go we'll take them up here and we'll unload them grab our trailer load it up and load this bell spike up again and uh, we'll probably take these straw bells and just put them in that barn um, like I said I want a little shed Oh, I hope we don't get crop destruction when I do this. I don't think you get it on grass, whatever stage it is. Okay, good. Uh, that one section's red mow, but this sudden I'm waiting on it to grow to match. Um, let's see, do this without making a big mess. And why? Unload bells here. All right, now that, that was perfect. I like that. And lower loading platforms. Why? And then you just leave that like it is, and it should load again. Yep. Okay. Unload. Load here. And there's no collision on the spikes. So that's good. Finally found something that works decent. So folks, I am very sorry we didn't get very much done. Um, I need to go pick up that plow. Uh, what I'm going to do is... Uh, right over here see their food is still it's no mess there we need to lay some more gravel um, I do want to do a couple more missions now and, and get these uh, other fields I, I, I know what I'm going to do folks instead of buying that other field right now let me show y'all this real quick we bought field 22, okay? Field 22's got trees here. And, of course, trees over here. Alright. This one's got quite a bit of fir trees over here. What I'm going to do, there's a auto-load wood trailer. I don't know if it's in tippers or... Probably forestry. Do we have? Yes, we do. Should be all the way to the back. Auto low wood. Um, nothing's all the way wood. Okay. I think this is when you do the front and the back. It has two different spots to put it, and this one just loads it uh, in this wood chipper here if that's the right one stump cutter attachment for a Bronx oh this is Kentucky farmers here okay um, this in here What is it? Uh, one, two, three, that's 10,000. And this is 100,000. All right, this is a. Uh, tree cutter, chipper, and stump grinder all in one. We'll probably rent this thing for making wood chips out of the ones that we can't put on the timber runner so yeah that or bring back the one we got uh, this thing is 5,000 so that's not <laughs> yeah anyway we need uh, the auto load of the timber runner and we need this so instead of buying that other piece of ground I'm going to buy this in the trailer and probably borrow a little bit more, folks, 
and to go in and get us just the tractor part. Um, is it this one? Yes, it's this one here. Um, it's by Stevie. Um, so while I'm in here, you know what I'm gonna go ahead and do? Uh, Ago Gray. I think I like the Ago better. It's, I don't know something about it. And we're gonna go. Uh, let's try that. Got a little shine there. Main color. Yeah, we're gonna go with the darker blue, the, the gold hopper, or whatever how you say it. Uh, engine setup. The max 116. <laughs> Why? I tell you what, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get this in here. It's 111,000. It's not the biggest, but it's not the smallest either. So it's right in the middle. So I'm going to go ahead and buy this baby while I'm in here. So y'all can see it. And we can go to the store, look at it, and all that good stuff. So here we go. There we go. And there's our plow by a Kentucky Farmer. I don't know what we can put on the back of it. It's got a hitch for the back too, so. Too bad we couldn't carry it with this. Or can we? No, it just look like different hitch attachments. Now I'm gonna pull this thing out of the way. Oh no, it just fell over. Let's look inside real quick. Uh, pretty much plain Jane, but at least everything is detailed. Oh yeah, I would love to be in this truck. Just uh, oh, just hauling seeds for one. But this is like a uh, we can pull a low boy with or some kind of flatbed. We can haul uh, track holes and stuff like that. What it looks like. But I'm gonna. Eh, borrow a little bit more money and get the flatbed trailer or not the flatbed but the auto load trailer and get that stump grinder and stuff so I'm gonna need to bring the Samar up here empty oh I love this truck I love this truck I don't like the lug nut covers they should be more rounded I don't like the spiky kind but I love to have this truck in real life. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, I need to go down here and make sure these doors are open. I think they are. Um, this is not stacked very well. Uh, I don't know. I don't think I'll take time to stack it. But I'm thinking about bringing the straw. Um putting the straw over here against the wall so uh yeah all right folks i'm gonna get off here and get this stuff done uh i know y'all tired of seeing this box here uh but uh yeah i'm going here i don't know i probably need a hundred thousand Ooh, i'm at 935 right now I hope I can borrow that much more. Oh, I can go up to two. Uh oh. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, it was 1.13925. Ooh, that's going to be a lot of money, folks. A lot of money. I'm going to put some back in. Um, but yeah. So, uh,. Thank you again. Oh, thank each and every one of y'all so much for uh, staying with me, support me, and all that good stuff. And it, it means so much to me, folks. It, it really does. Where's the... Uh, oh, for sure. I'll probably return that in there. I'll bring it up on my way. 
Uh, Bronx all in one. Uh, we we going, folks. You know what color we're gonna go? We're gonna go blue. See, it's the only thing we can do. So, uh, bye. But uh, yeah, appreciate each and every one of y'all coming out, folks. I'm gonna get uh this other stuff here. I'm gonna try to figure out which one I need. Um. I, I think this is cheaper. Oh, right, that looks better. Uh, both of them got the same thing. So, you know what? I'm going to try this in here. It's 2000 cheaper. So, and I think this is the one, so I'm going to go with wide tires. Uh, I, I, I think that's the one you can load anywhere you want to. I'm going to have to uh, demonstrate on that. Um, so I still got her in 10,000. Um, put that back in the bank because I sure don't want to uh, mess around and spend a lot of money that will get me in trouble so now we gotta do is buy a hopper bottom and uh, we'd be good to go um, this is supposed to be an auto load What is it doing here? I'm supposed to be able to stretch something. Fast and tension belts. Yeah, it's got belts. That's good. Oh no, my controller's starting to do that again. Tell me I messed up. Uh, uh, stop auto load switch auto load to right. Start unloading wood. Show loading position. Oh, here we go. Ah, that's what makes it move. Uh, 1.5. So if I wanted 6 mil logs, it would be right there. And then that much would probably hang off the back. But if I go all the way to there, I don't know. I just have to try it and see, folks. But I'm going to fill this baby up, if you know what I mean. But, uh, yeah, um, you can do Z, do that, and that's all your other stuff there. So, huh, might not be as bad as I thought. But anyway, folks, I got to get off here. It's 43 minutes already. And like I said, I'm going to bring the Samar up here. I'm probably going to do some missions off screen. You know what? I was going to get that hay trailer, too. But I'll use the little one first. Got the beacon lights. Any on the trailer. No hitch back here. Ooh, bright reverse lights. Um, uh, turn the uh, hazards on. Okay, we got good hazards there. Let's check the trailer out. Got them on the truck. Got them on the trailer. All right. And our turn signals. Okay. 
There's our clearance lights on the truck. I just wondered if it was going to work. Okay. All right, folks. Y'all have a great day. A blessed day. And I will see y'all hopefully tomorrow. If not, the next day. So, later.